All right, guys, so if you're using a Discord application for quite a long time, and if you're having problem with that, let's say microphone, especially when it comes to talk to your friends or maybe sending that voice message, and if you see it doesn't really work whatsoever, then don't worry, because in this video, we're gonna go ahead and show you some quick tips and tricks that you can apply on your iOS device to fix your problem. Now, to fix your problem, the very first things that you want to do from here is very simple. The first things I want you to do, just go ahead and open up your settings and then scroll down to your privacy and come down here and scroll down to your microphone. Now, go ahead and tap your microphone and then make sure to toggle on your Discord application from here because if you see your Discord is turned off or toggled off from here, then you won't be able to use the microphone while you're using this application. Now, after turning on this microphone from here, the next things you want to simply do is simple. Now, go ahead and open up your Discord applications on your iPhone and then go ahead and tap on your profile. And once you've done that, and if you just go ahead and scroll down from here, then you'll be able to find this option called voice. Now, go ahead and tap your voice. And you can use sensitivity the way you actually want to use it on your iPhones. Now, it is highly recommendable for you auto sensitivity so that your iPhone can understand how much you actually require for your audio. Now additionally you can check your volume and at the same time all you got to do is just go ahead and toggle all of this option from here. Now you can simply tap noise separations, echo cancellations and also you want to toggle on this automatic gain control to get better quality of audio on your iPhone. So now after doing all of the process, now all I want you to do is simple, just go ahead and just turn off your iPhone and turn it back on and then go ahead and check whether it's working or not. All right guys, after that, you'll be able to use your Discord application with your voice and the problem will be gone forever. And this is how you can fix a problem. Hopefully this video is useful. If so, be sure to hit the like button and feel free to subscribe to the channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thanks for watching and see you next time.